Hi everybody, I've been so excited about this book the last week or two that I've been reading it. It's called Bold by Peter Diamandis. He's an entrepreneur and he actually helped to start Singular University and people had told me about his book Abundance and I saw this book Bold previously but wow, every single chapter I've been blown away by. I've been listening to it on Audible um, as a, an audio book and I was on the plane going to Brazil and wow, I was just flabbergasted with all all of the changes in technology that he explains is now democratizing the ability for anyone, all of us are in a similar playing field to create, let's say, a million dollar, a billion dollar idea or company. So the idea is if you can create a solution for a billion people, you probably can have a billion dollar idea or sell your company in the future for a billion dollars. And he starts off talking about Kodak, the mammoth, for a hundred years they were really dominating the field and then they developed the digital camera. And then after they just didn't think it was something the public wanted and suddenly you know after the Japanese had kind of also run with it the cameras started to be very mainstream and such and then in I think 2009 two college students started Instagram there were 13 employees Facebook a year later bought it for a billion dollars and then Kodak basically went bankrupt so these kinds of technologies that are surfacing now that he discusses can actually topple huge mammoth companies and he explains that these are called exponential technologies and how we can utilize those as well as the power of crowdfunding or crowdsourcing so he gives, uh, he gives a lot of tips about campaigns that let's say you would do on something like a Kickstarter. He explains all the statistics about how things, uh, micro lending sites such as Kiva had actually really transformed this whole industry. So now there are minds from around the world who are able to contribute to a lot of our ideas. So for instance, you can actually start a company he proposes which a lot of people have done for a couple thousand dollars and you sub it out to these micro or macro job sites such as Fiverr such as uh, there's freelancer.com and he gives the history of a lot of these campaigns and what I loved about what he explains in the crowdfunding chapter is some strategies and tips for how to really stand out so he explains that if you want to raise tens of thousands as opposed to hundreds of thousands as opposed to millions these are the things you need to do you need to find affiliate partners you need to uh, have an interesting idea um, he, he had started about 15 companies and he said for instance with their company they were as a gift as part of uh, one of the crowdfunding uh, things they would do a selfie in space <laughs> so uh, there were just many really unique ideas I'm not doing it justice right now in, in 82 he was actually at MIT and convinced all these international universities to help fund this international space university with different programs around the world and since then the last few years he's been able to bring on board people such as Richard Branson, he's worked with Elon Musk, people like Larry Page from Google and such so it was really exciting to see how he explained how you can convince the public about uh, a huge idea so he's doing mining of asteroids and and so he gave the idea for the crowdfunding that you could actually uh, name an asteroid after someone or uh, you know you can say that perhaps this is going to benefit school children and what school it will go to at some point this telescope that he's helping to build so he's had multiple uh, technologies multiple companies he spoke about and he has so many phenomenal people endorsing him I just saw Ray Kurzweil at this Emerge conference here at the Miami Beach Convention Center a week ago and he's a futurist and those graphs were just incredible about the nanobots in our capillaries and how we'll be connected to the cloud soon and a lot of his predictions were correct and he's um, been working with Google to sort of teach the robots 
uh, about how to be intelligent. So in this bold book, they talk about all the artificial intelligence and all the augmented reality, the 3D printing that's going to transform the way we live. So there's just a lot of neat things and we'll be on the pulse of technology with uh, robotics and all these other fascinating things. Um, you know, people like Clinton and all these Michael Dell, people have really uh, understood the value that he brings. So I just wanted to share that with you all and feel free to take a peek. Have a great week.